Hey, what's up everybody? This is Blitzwing Ben back here for another video and today we're going to be taking a look at the Transformers 8012 Optimus Renge version Optimus Prime. And here he is in his robot mode and he looks really cool. Um, quality control, like I said, isn't too good. I think I got a knockoff. But um, anyway, my next figure will be, figures will be Scrap Metal for Devastator and um, actually not Skipjack and um, Legendary Optimus Prime or Tribute Optimus Prime or the Dark of the Moon Studio Series 1. Um, I really want another Optimus Prime because this one just doesn't do it for me, you know. He looks really great. I just can't pose and play with him though that well. So, yeah, but it is what it is. So, here he is in a really cool looking battle pose. So, there he is, a full 360 of him. He looks amazing. Like, don't get me wrong. He looks so accurate and cool for a Voyager scale. He just doesn't, you know, work very well. Um, like hold together sometimes, but anyway, let's go over the articulation, shall we? So head, um, can look left and right. You can't unfortunately lift it up and down unless you untab that piece there. Um, these pieces are on ball joints. Um, the, uh, sun visors, um, arms hinge at the shoulder, move in and out, up and down. Um, got a little mecha live gimmick there where that little piece inside there, that bronze piece kind of moves as the arm does, or it stays in place as the arm moves. So he's got bicep swivel. Um, over 90 degrees of bend at the elbow and the wrist can hinge up and down a little bit. Um, nothing at the waist due to the way he transforms. He's got a soft ratcheted, um, legs kick forward, back, can do in and out that far only. Um, if you untab these wheel sections here, he does get a thigh swivel. It's very loose though on mine. Very, very loose thigh swivel. But there we go. Here we have him. Um, he's got single bend, in, bend at the knees, but they can go a little over 90 degrees of bend. Um, knee pads articulate. This section untabbed all the time, so if you move that in and out if you want. Uh, ankles can pivot uh, back and forth and uh, side to side a little bit. No rotation. But um, let's get his backpack tabbed in and his waist tabbed in like it is supposed to be. Oh, come on now. Man, this guy is just... He is a fiddly one. So... Yeah. He's a little hard to handle. But, there we go. Let's have the backpack in. Let's have the crotch back in. There we go. And now he's got his battle blades, like I said. Um, extra feature you can do is you can fold the battle blades in and collapse them into his arms, and they tab into the arms as well, into the forearms. If you can line it upright, 